people know. Can we not pass the same? We give it over to him. Um, AJ, uh, can we just put a round of applause and welcome AJ? I think he's going to introduce our our our. Um, Pray wow. I forgot about praying to because I'm extremely excited. <laughs> You do to an exciting man, he forgets everything. <laughs> you just need it right now, I forgot everything, but we are gonna bow our heads. <laughs> In all our excitement, like I said, God will always be acknowledged. Yes. Don't forget like me, you know, I'm just joking. Close your eyes and let's pray. Good Lord, once again, this is milestone achievement. Words cannot explain what we have just seen. Father God, you have heard our prayers. Our mother's prayer, our children's prayer, and our father's prayer. In a country that is so blessed with abundant resource, we become so poor. And God, because of your love and concern for us, you have sent in global for us. So that through in global as a medium by which we can be blessed. And over the last two days, we have been totally blessed. Extremely blessed, unprescribable, and we give you glory and praise and honor for that. Yeah. Yeah. This morning, we now commit this gathering and what we will do today in your hand. And may, Lord, we pray once again as you have done. You've given us a good weather. You've given us all these good things continuously. You are going to do them again to us. You will bless us today. This gathering, we put that in your hand and we ask this prayer in Jesus' name and everyone say, Amen. Amen. Thank you very much. Gabe! Ah. Are you happy? Yes! I'm really very happy because this is the right time that you know yourself that eight global is real in Papua New Guinea. Are you proud? Yes! Are you proud to be part of eight global? Yes! This is the start of our journey. <laughs> Believe me, three years from now, this will be time stamp times 100 because eight global is the number one. Okay? And then right now, I will give this mic to our powerful speaker and inter international trainer, none other than, but we need to give a powerful millionaire club. Yes. Okay? Before I call this powerful speaker, this is an international trainer, but we need to give a powerful millionaire club. Not an ordinary millionaire club. Okay? We want you to give your best right now. No reservation, okay? Okay, one million! Whoa! I can hear you. Make it loud. Okay, one million! This is really a, a gift from God. Alliance in Motion Global and each and everyone in this room today is really a gift from God. Do you agree? Yes. There is a purpose while you're sitting in this chair. You know, I can never forget and remember the time that we also started the ribbon cutting, the moment we started the office and the grand launching also in Africa. We have plenty of offices in Africa. We have opened mo so much business center offices, branches of A Global. And I can see the, you know, the similarities. I can see the similarity on how excited, how, uh, how people from Africa accepted AIM Global. And the same that you are doing here in Papua New Guinea. But I believe that even there is too much, the population there is too much. Here in PNG, we are that much less, but still, I believe in the quality over quantity. Yeah. I believe all of the pioneers in this room will be the quality leaders of AIM Global in PNG. And we will be the one to bring the good news of AIM Global to different countries along this Asia. Is that good? Yeah. You know, I'm so excited, you know, I believe some of you have attended our uh, event last uh, two days ago. In the same, all of you attended, right? Yes. All of you attended also our AIM Academy. Did you learn a lot? Yes. So I hope all of the things that you've learned during the AIM Academy, I hope that doesn't end only that day. I hope you bring those skills, you bring those knowledge throughout your business once you do AIM Global every day. 
What you just need to do is to bring in global deal. Bring in global deal. Make it as a lifestyle. Can you please say lifestyle? Lifestyle. Make in global as a lifestyle. We have a culture in this office. You know, as we, as we uh, become successful in in global PNG, you will be the pioneers of Papua New Guinea. Yeah. We are just starting. And uh, in behalf of the management, in behalf of the board of directors, in behalf of our visionary president, Dr. Ed Tobacco, coming straight from them, you know, Papua New Guinea is now uh, Dr. Ed's, our visionary president's baby. He is his favorite copy right now that he would like to really focus on. That's why he would like to, uh, you know, uh, bring out the greetings and congratulations for each and every one of you in behalf of also of our director for Inter international affairs, Dr. Connie Kavantov. We would like to uh, express their gratitude and welcome and congratulations to every leaders of Papua New Guinea. Can you give a round of applause for each and every one? Also, this event, this grand launching will not be possible if not because of our management here in uh, PNG. Can we give a round of applause for Mamshina and our staff in, P in PNG? And of course, uh, we will not be grown large like this. You know, they, 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 uh, there was, we have opened so many branches. But uh, this is history. Can you say history? History. Can you imagine ribbon cutting, ground launching? In just our ground launching, we stormed the biggest, one of the biggest indoor arena in your country. Yeah. So can you imagine what will happen during the first year anniversary if we will do the Get Eight program? Yeah. If all of you right now will multiply to eight. For the next two months and the next four months, we will be able to back into 16 and to 64. And to, can you imagine what will happen to us right now? See, that is the reason why AIM Global is looking forward to improve and innovate Papua New Guinea. So you just need to stay, you just need to be strong, you just need to believe in our system, and our system will do the rest. Is that okay? Yes. So, again, can you give a round of applause for our coaches and international trainers from Papua New Guinea? Like my story, if you remember my story during the first day on our opening remarks for our God launch, you remember the story of the bird of paradise? Yes. In your language, you call that what? Kumol. 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 Did I say it right? Kumol. Yes. This beautiful Kumol, remember that? Yes. All of you are not just typical Kumol in our eyes. Wow. In the eyes of your international trainers, in our eyes, in the eyes of Doc Ed, in the eyes of Sir Jurgen, in our eyes, you are the most beautiful, you are the most colorful, you are the most rarest, you are the most fastest, you are the biggest, you are the greatest Kumol right now in Papua New Guinea. Are you proud of yourself? Yeah. You need to believe in yourself. You don't have the right not to believe in yourself because we believe in you that we can do it as well. Yeah. If Africa can do it, if Asia and Filipinos can do it, Definitely, Papua New Guineans can do it. Yeah. Yeah. That is why you need to believe in yourself. We just need to cut those branches where you are sitting right now. Get out of your comfort zone. Come on, top your neighbors, your neighbor. Get out of your comfort zone. <laughs> <laughs> we are just starting. We are just starting, and we are here to stay forever. Yeah. Yeah. If you guys think about it, this international trainers, the management, in global board of directors, we are the farmers that will never stop to cut those branches. We will cut those branches for you to have no choice, for you to go down out of your comfort zone, and for you to have no choice to learn and get up to your greatest potential, and for you to have no choice but to fly high in Alliance in Motion Nova. Congratulations to all of you. God bless all of you. And without further ado, I think I need to call. It's my pleasure to call, ladies and gentlemen. When I heard that I'll be accompanying uh, my mentor back in the Philippines, I am so so happy because just traveling with him, I will definitely learn a lot. Just by hearing him talk again, I will definitely learn a lot. I believe you've learned a lot from him yesterday. Yeah. 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 Even me, even me, I was sitting in the side and I was really listening a lot because every time he talks, there's something new. And this guy, ladies and gentlemen, is one of the best person that really started why AIM Global is so big today. Wow. He is the person, one of the person that is the really reason why AIM Global is stable for 11 years and we are expanding globally and continuing becoming better, brighter, and bolder. Are you ready to welcome him? Yeah. Are you ready? Ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, let's welcome our mentor, the Encyclopedia of Networking. Hello? Hello, what an Encyclopedia of Networking is? 
You know what an encyclopedia is? Yes. Yeah. He knows everything about the industry. Yeah. It's like a walking encyclopedia. <laughs> Whatever you ask about the industry, he can answer you. He can mentor you. He can coach you. Yes. It's all about from one million. Oh. No, not like that. One million. Oh. Thank you, Nico. I am in front of multi-millionaires. Uh, Dabay na muna. Asu Sam Zumba. Good plan morning, AIM Global, PNG. Uh, you know, yesterday or the other day, during my speech, I was saying that uh, we are uh, Papua New Guinea, AIM Global Papua New Guinea is making history. Yes. Uh, we're doing a lot of your, you guys, our leaders here, our distributors here. You are creating a record-breaking history here, wow. as far as our branches all over the world is concerned. <laughs> and today is another record-breaking. You know why? Because I believe you've been in this office only for the last five months. That's correct. Right. And today was symbolic. Today is symbolic in a way that I've cut the ribbon uh, just to become, you know, formally for our grand launching today. Yes. When in fact, we've been using this office for five months. Am I right? Yes. yes. Why, in my opinion, is this record breaking? Because symbolically speaking, I am cutting the ribbon today with this so-called new office, but we will have a new office in less than five months. Uh, in behalf of our board of directors, Dr. Ed, Dr. Uh, Dr. Oni, Sir John Asperin, and Francis Miguel, I'd like to give you good news that uh, you know you you try to maximize this office because in less than five months you will have a new office here in Papua New Guinea. We like to have a bigger office, yes or no? Yes! So again, we will do everything that in less than five months, five months from now, uh, we will give you a bigger and uh, newer office so that we can accommodate more prospects, so that the environment, the office will be more conducive for our prospects. And we believe that you deserve a bigger office because you've done a very wonderful job over the last five months. And I know, in my heart, we are just getting started. And we believe that uh, we've never, we will never be able to accomplish all this, of course, without the effort of your international coaches and international mentors. So, so at this point in time, of course, I'd like to recognize all our international trainers. Okay, can we ask them to please go up the stage, our coaches, mentors? Can you give them the best round of applause? You have to understand that these people have their own families in the Philippines. And they, they sacrifice a lot going here, training you, mentoring you. And one of the things I commend the Papua New Guineans, especially our distributors, Pastor Luke, is that I can see and I can feel that our leaders here, you, our distributors, you are so teachable. Yes. You have that kind of good learning attitude. You listen attentively. When I was up the stage, for the last two days, every time I walk either to the left side of the stage or right side of the stage, I can see heads, heads, synchronized going to the left, <laughs> synchronized going to the right. That's why if you will notice, I, am, I was already playing going this way because I want to see your head going that way. I am going this way because I want to... And guess what? But every time I look down, some of you also look down. <laughs> and that just means you really are teachable. You have a unique, good learning attitude. And we are very, very excited for that because for the last so many years that I've been in, the, in this industry, ladies and gentlemen, I've seen people become so successful because of that kind of attitude. 
be teachable. Ladies and gentlemen, it doesn't matter, as I've said in my trainings, it doesn't matter what is your past. Your past has nothing to do with your tomorrows, with your future. It doesn't matter. Forget about your past. Let's all move forward. Learn the business. Learn from these wonderful people. Okay? Do the business correctly. Apply the right principle. Ladies and gentlemen, I've seen people coming from humble beginnings. But now, you cannot even trace anything, something about their past, past that uh, tells them that they did not finish college. You cannot see them that, uh, you know, they came from a humble beginning now because right now, those people who are very successful in the global, they can speak very well in front of a lot of people. Mm -hmm. You cannot even see any trace that these people are uneducated and illiterate. Can you just imagine what transformation in global can do to you? Yes. And can you imagine, in my experience, if you are able to develop yourself personally and financially, guess what? You affect a lot of people, especially your loved ones. Yes. So that's why it is your moral responsibility. It is your moral responsibility, ladies and gentlemen, to have a better life. Because if you get a better life, then your loved ones will get the better life as well. Exactly. Yes. That's why, again, I'm telling you, we are in the right opportunity already. You are in the right opportunity now. Ladies and gentlemen, AIM Global is not on trial here anymore. That's it. Why? Because we've proven ourselves for the last 11 years creating more than 5,000 millionaires and counting because thousands and thousands of people in this country will also become a part of the millionaire data. By next year, we will be 6,000. By next, next year, we will be 7,000. By next, next, next year, we will be 8,000 because thousands and thousands of people from this country will add up to that millionaire circle here in Angelica. Ladies and gentlemen, it is very important to have the right opportunity. Can you say right opportunity? Right opportunity. Because many people are working so hard. Many people have no direction in their lives. It doesn't matter how, sl how slow you go. If you feel that you are slow in this business in terms of creating results, ladies and gentlemen, it doesn't matter. As long as you have the right direction, it doesn't matter how slow you go. Yes. Because many people are fast going nowhere anywhere. Yes. Many people are fast going anywhere. So I might as well, you know, be slow, but slowly and surely. You are now in the right company. You are now in the right opportunity. You have the best mentors. We have the best products. We have the right infrastructure. We have a great president. We have a great board of directors whose heart is so big that these people, I work closely with our board of directors. And ladies and gentlemen, I'm telling you, they sleep late every morning. Mm -hmm. Why? Thinking and planning on how we can help more distributors to become successful. Yeah. That's why I'm telling you, this is a pro-distributor company because we are not just in a business. Ladies and gentlemen, AIM Global is in a mission. Wow. We are not just in a business, my friends. That separates us from a lot of networking companies because we are not just into a business. We are in a mission. Our mission, my friends, is to help more people become successful. Our mission is to make more millionaires our mission is to teach people, bring out the potential in them. Yeah. Yeah. Develop people in such a way that they will believe in themselves because the moment you start believing in yourself is the first step towards getting your dreams. Yeah. But let me tell you and remind you again, dreams without the right opportunity, ladies and gentlemen, will remain a dream. Yes. Yes. To turn dream into a reality, you must have the right opportunity. Yes, and believe me, my friends, I'm telling you, the world, our problem is not the lack of opportunity. No. It is not the lack of opportunity. 
It is the lack of our resourcefulness. Yes, yes, yes. There are so many opportunities out there. But ladies and gentlemen, let me ask you. Are you qualified? No, no. I saw a business there with a, a, a fast food the chicken house somewhere there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a DFC. That's correct, DFC. Probably the owner of DFC is, you know, have you know very successful and probably he has money or she they have money. It's a good opportunity, am I right? Yes. yes. Restaurant business is a good opportunity, right? That chicken house DFC over there is a good opportunity, right? Yes. So if it's a good opportunity and that is a vehicle to get your dreams as well, it could be the right opportunity, but the question mark is this. Are you qualified? No. Do you have the money to put up that kind of business? No. I see a lot of uh, telecom companies here. Do you know a telecom company? Yes, yes. yes. It's a good opportunity. You know, put up this telecom company. You know, technology nowadays is a good business. It's a good opportunity, but the question is, are you qualified to have that kind of business? No. no. I see some successful engineers, accountants, I see some successful other professionals here like doctors and lawyers. But again, that could be a good opportunity to get our dreams. But the question is, are you qualified? Because most people, when they don't have money, how they can get a good education anyway? So there's a lot of opportunities out there. But the thing is, are you qualified? I've got good news for you, my friend. Because Aim Global is a good company, is the right opportunity, is a good business. But everybody here, every one of you here, is qualified to become a successful distributor of Aim. Are you with me? Yes. Are you getting what I'm saying? Yes. Because there could be a lot of opportunities, but then again, a lot of people are not qualified for that opportunity. Whereas in Aim Global, it doesn't matter who you are. Doesn't matter if you came from a very humble beginning. Doesn't matter if you came from a poor family. Doesn't matter if you have no diploma. Doesn't matter if you're not bright. Doesn't matter if you're not smart. I've been in this industry long enough to tell you, I've seen thousands of people practically. People who cannot even write and read. But now, they can drive their own car. They know how to read the traffic lights. Yeah. <laughs> I've, I've met so many people, highly educated people, people with flying colors, flying honors when they graduated. But even if you have the right, if you are smart, if you are, you know, knowledgeable, if you are intelligent, but if you are in the in the wrong opportunity, in the wrong direction, your intelligence serves you nothing. Yes, 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 yes. 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 Am I right? Yes. I saw a lot of people graduate on top of their class. We call that cum laude, magna cum laude, first honors. At the end of the day, they live on a hand-to-mouth existence. That's right. They are beholden to their boss. They have no freedom. They have no power to choose. But I saw people here in networking, especially in AIM Global could barely finish elementary, did not even step a foot in tertiary level. Yes, yeah. Illiterate, cannot practically read a lot of complex, you know, sentences. Right. They present in global with clear books because they cannot write. <laughs> they present in global opportunity and product presentation with iPad. So that you will just keep turning the pages like that and you don't have to write anymore. <laughs> you just have to use your point finger and point, point, point. <laughs> Practically illiterate. But ladies and gentlemen, they are driving brand new cars, living the life of their dreams, living in their houses, with beautiful furnitures, taking a vacation elsewhere, taking their kids to the best 